What's up, YouTube? I'm Baron the Noble Man, and today is my birthday. I'm turning. I just turned 24 years old. Um, yeah. It's, I'm sorry if I sound a little bit tired. I stood up really late last night, and you know, I really, I really couldn't. Um, I was waiting for this game to come out, and I played a good round. This is my second uh video. My first video, I made it to round 17. So I'm about to shut up now and I'm gonna let uh, the game play out. Also, if anybody is a Pulp Fiction fan, that's Marcellus Wallace, and I'm pretty sure those are those are other actors as a, as another actor and other actresses. But um, I don't really remember their name, but I remember them look reading up on something. But yeah, back to shutting the hell up. And who can forget the Merkur's salt line? Yeah, yeah, I know what I did, but hold your applause. I'd rather try knobbing a Roman donut for a bust my arse with your pennies again. It's not worth it, mate. Duly noted, which brings us to Middleburg and the current operation. Dr. Fisher? Ten days ago, we received a dossier. Material smuggled out by a young Austrian scientist who's reconsidering his loyalties. In it, he provides the location of a hidden bunker, where Dr. Straub and Colonel Richter have been collecting some peculiar pieces. Whatever they found, it's being used to power some kind of experiment. You have no idea what you're dealing with, do you? Your mission is to seize that relic. Everything else is on a need-to-know basis. Is it just me? Or does it seem that we do a wee bit late to the party? I didn't sign up for this shite. None of us did. But here we are, and you have your mission just as I have mine. To find and rescue the scientist who risked his life to get us this intelligence. Klaus Fischer, my brother. I'm in antiquities, darling. Not search and rescue. Best of luck. What the hell was that? Does he look like a bitch? What? Say what one more time. I really like this. I like how how you how you start off like this. You know you don't have to do the prologue. I chose to do the prologue. All right, so I can't stand up. I want to stand up. I can't. Oh, he has something important. That it looks what like. Is this? Yep. Close mention strange devices. <gasps> it closed my wounds. So she finds something on a um on a zombie and what just decides to inject herself with it? Like you, is that your first instinct that you find a needle and you're like, hey, you know, fuck it, let me inject myself with it. What's the worst that could happen? Sorry guys, I'm, I'm just getting a feel for the scenery. I really like how fucking beautiful this looks. And like, I love how, how scary this shit is, man. I went 17 rounds yesterday, which is not a lot, but I was by myself since the servers were down. And just, I'm telling you, there was like a fuck fest of, of a whole bunch of different creatures. And you guys are gonna see, I'm gonna upload it in my second video, but in this video, um, I'm just gonna go through it as, as it sees fit. Alright, also there's a, oh alright, I was about to say if there's a light attack and a heavy attack, but I guess there's just a regular melee attack, try to get me with that jump scare, what the fucking looks like. That soldier, he, he shouldn't be alive. He shouldn't, he couldn't, 
but he is. Okay, so this is just a tutorial. I remember that farmhouse. It's a ghostly place. But I like it. It looks it looks What's really good. More of those broken soldiers. Where I didn't see no broken soldiers. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's basically the prologue. I mean, not the pro oh yeah, it's the prologue, but it's just a tutorial. And for those who are watching and have no idea, yeah, you can still, you can still swing with with R three. All right, so he already saw me, so might as well kill your ass. Oh, I can't go back outside. Really? Damn, I wanted to explore. MP40. Not to All right. Use this energy from the dead to unlock the arms cache. How efficient! I need to kill these creatures to open this door. And another thing is, um, the windows. You can't close windows anymore. Nope. The once they start breaking them in and they're coming in, that's it. But it's only wave two. If you have some um, um, zombies skill from previous games under your belt, I feel like you're going to do fine. It's all about really knowing where you're going and what you got to get and what those what. That's what's really going to kill you. Like there's different names, but they're basically the similar, um, similar shit. And I could just open the door right now, but I want to have at least one. I know there, I feel like there's more that's gonna spawn if I just leave one. Okay, so she has a free fire perk. Yeah, this is where you get armor. Really, man? All right, now I'm gonna pull out my gun. Because usually in most uh, Call of Duty games, when it comes to Wave Three, if you're still new to this, if you haven't seen it at all, or haven't played a Call of Duty game, usually Wave Three is like, you know, knifing and some gun action, just because they don't go down as easily as they did in Round One and Two. Well, in Round One, you just um, knife them, and Round Two, it takes two knives. Yeah, see, that was three. But I'm not gonna do that because it's just waste time. They're gonna crowd up pretty quick. Yeah, I know. I'm not gonna escape yet. When, when you unlock more perks, you could, um, you could, uh, have, you could start the game with shields already. So you won't have to waste money. And they're only a thousand. Killed your ass. Oh no! Leave me alone. That's a thing. Two. 
Bob? No, that's her screaming. Yeah. I told you she they get scared and when you when they when they get scared, your your character gets jumpy. You get scared like when you turn the corner and um and you don't see um a zombie and then like it just pops up out of nowhere Jesus. I just got revived the revived soda but it's not really the soda now you put your hand on it and it shocks you oh, yeah, yeah. This area is fucking closed in. This motherfucker just ran right past my bullets. Oh, it's getting super cluttered in here now. To proceed, you know, you gotta get to 45. 45? Yep, to proceed. What was it before? 35. So now it's 45? Yep. 10 more levels. But you unlock stuff pretty early in the game. Like at level 5, you start unlocking a couple of things. I'm already at level three. I wish they had more power ups in this house. There's only two power ups. There's the shield. There's one gun, and there's um, and the uh, the thing to revive yourself with. What I need is something to load the gun faster. Yeah, but if I, haven't, I haven't found it yet. But they have it. Here we go. Made it to round seven. <clears throat> How many rounds did you? How many rounds did you do that? I don't know. I have, I'm, I'm still doing the prologue. Does that count as level up? Yeah, that's how that's how I'm leveling up too. Well, imagine all of this shit in a little house. With, with one gun. 
and uh, to get ammo, the ammo's all the way in the living room. And then the zombies are running. Did you find a missing box? No, I'm telling you, there's nothing in this house but one gun and shields and um and armor. I mean armor and uh, the thing to pick you up, revive. Nothing else. In the uh, uh, the official map, there's the in the mystery the official map, there's the um there's the the mystery box and all of that. But in this one, the prologue, nothing to help you. Round eight. No, round nine. And the cool thing about it is they, when the round starts, they, they show you a timer on how long it takes the, for the next round to start. Yeah. yeah. So you pretty much you know when the, when the round is going to end, right? No, you don't know when it's going to end. When the, when the next one is going to start, yeah, it, after after you kill the last zombie, it would like be like 10, 9, 8. Yeah. Oh, she just got terrified. At least no, at least there's no special zombies in this shit. So you said the zombie with no arms, they, they like the dog? Yeah. Fuck, I'm out of ammo. At least ammo for this gun is only 500 gold. Bitches. Very good. Damn, I only have a uh, 194 kills. But I have 259 headshots. How many headshots you got? 259. Damn. I'm on wave 10. Right now, I'm hanging out like mad close to the ammo. Catching me. No grenades, nothing, man. Wave eleven. No, I'm on wave 11, round 11. Yeah. Shit. 
Shit. Shit. Damn, this girl's annoying. I don't blame her for being scared, but still. Wave 11. Oh, wave 12. They didn't give me no max ammo, no nuke, nothing. They still have the nuke, but they call it something else. Yeah. Well, technically, they didn't really change it. All they did was just put the German name for it. Move your ass! Oh, I went down. Made it <laughs> barely. I thought you said you went down. Yeah, Salalova.